Thank you, Jason. We're just days away from Saturday's Rock Hall induction ceremony, and tonight the Mickey Hart Band will perform on the Rock Hall's main stage. The band features the drummer from the legendary band, The Grateful Dead. And tomorrow a new exhibit opens featuring items from The Grateful Dead. The band was inducted into the Hall of Fame in 1994. This new exhibit will include finished and working manuscripts for some of their classic songs. I want with this exhibit for people who love The Grateful Dead to come here and experience something that they have never seen before with The Grateful Dead. And I want those who really aren't fans or casual fans to walk away with a greater knowledge of what the band meant to people around them. Uh, the exhibit opens at 10 o'clock tomorrow morning and runs through the month of December. And now the man we've been waiting for! Yeah. Who is that man? Well, I will tell you, it was a kick to be on the stage. I had the honor of being Master of Ceremonies for the Rock My Soul concert. It featured gospel artist Kirk Franklin, a seven-time Grammy winner. Kirk Franklin was specifically honored by the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame. The concert was a big hit with a sold-out crowd at the State Theater at Playhouse Square, and Kirk Franklin was magnificent. By the way, be sure to check out our special Rock Hall section on Newsnet5.com. It's everything rock and roll, including an interactive section called You Rock. It's under the Spotlight section. And I offer this reminder, check out our Rock Hall Induction Week special. On Friday night, Rock Comes Home will air from 8 o'clock until 9 o'clock here on News Channel 5. Beginning at 8 o'clock Friday night, we're going to rock. We'll show you how Cleveland is getting ready for the induction ceremony and how we became the rock and roll capital.